What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a fabulous Tuesday. I um, was listening to a few songs before. Literally major throwbacks. Put on Hannah Montana. Who else loved Hannah Montana? That was like one of my favorite shows ever on Disney. For today's video, I wanted to do something a bit different. So one of you guys actually left a comment in I think yesterday's video or the day before's video basically and you mentioned something about Macy's having a sale I think it was Amanda if I'm not mistaken that's your name right so Amanda mentioned that Macy's is having like some amazing products on sale and I'm like hey let me check this out you know and so I went on Macy's site and realized they're actually having a 10 days of what is it called specifically the 10 days of glam with macy so basically they chose out 10 days starting from today which is the 11th of june where they choose out i think two to three makeup products that are going to be half off kind of i guess similar to like the ulta 20, 21 days of beauty event i feel like everyone is jumping on that but ulta did it first so yeah kind of similar to ulta which i mean i'm not complaining about because like who the hell does not love to get a good deal on a makeup product you know what i'm saying anyways i will have all the information down below in the description box as well as the links all of that have in mind that these sales are only for that specific day so once the day is over that the sale for that product is going to be like over like you can't get it for a reduced price tag so in today's video i'm going to run through each day let you know if i tried out the product if i like it if i recommend it let you know if i tried it out if i do not recommend it and let you know if i haven't tried it out and i want it for myself so let's go ahead and get started get some popcorn because it might be a long one but i'm, I'm trying not to talk for like forever <laughs> now you may charge it right now because this laptop is dying always it's always doing it to me this here charge my thingy my phone great all right let's do this also also something that's good to know is that if you do order why am i I'm whispering if you do order any of the products that's part of the 10 days of glam with macy's you can use glam 10 to get free shipping so just kind of like with ulta no matter how much you actually spend you get free shipping which is great All right, starting today, June 11th, we have the Smashbox Photo Finish Pore Minimizing Primer that's gonna be on sale. The original value of this is 39 bucks, which is crazily expensive, but it's gonna be on sale for $19.50. This is one that I actually own. I purchased this, I think for the full price tag about two years back. I really, really do like it. I feel like if you are someone who has larger pores, it's great to use in those areas just to minimize the appearance of your pores and to kind of fill them in so that when you apply your foundation, there's more of like a smoother base. So personally for $39, I would recommend it as well because I do find that it's actually a really, really nice primer. However, for the $19.50, it's kind of like, yeah, you need to run. So that is an amazing primer. I haven't used it in a long time. Even though I have dry skin, I still don't find that it dries me out and it's just really nice on the face in the summer and winter winter so that's a yes the next thing that's going to be on sale for today is the bare minerals bare skin complete coverage serum concealer so the original value of this concealer is 22 dollars, but it's on sale today for 11 bucks this is one that i actually have not tried it kind of intrigues me to an extent just because i love the fact that it says complete coverage serum concealer like it kind of give like it's kind of making me feel like it's gonna have a little bit of a hydrating feel under the eye area you know i haven't tried it yet so if you guys tried it and you think i should pick it up then definitely let me know if you think it, or if you think it's something i should skip out on then let me know too but for this one i'm kind of in between i can't recommend it of course because i haven't tried it but um yeah i'm in between about that one okay moving on to wednesday june 12th on this date we're going to be having the mario badescu vitamin c serum the original value of this is 45 bucks but it's going to be on sale for 22 dollars and 50 cents honestly i'm not going to come on here and act like i'm a smart ass about like skincare and stuff because i know a lot about skincare but i don't know everything about skincare i know that it's really really important to put on vitamin c um, i think it helps with anti-aging and a whole bunch of other stuff just started reading about it like literally very very recently so i'm still pretty new to it i don't use any vitamin c serums at all i use serums in general but not a vitamin c serums i don't know if there's a difference or what um i haven't tried this product but i will tell you guys that the few products that i have tried from Mario Badescu, i have like loved and enjoyed i still use a ton of their products it's in my bathroom so if you are looking for a vitamin c serum i do have high hopes for this one and i think it's going to work nicely just based on other products that i've tried from their brand but don't take my word on it 100 because i haven't tried it yet again with this if you guys have tried it please let us all know if it's worth it to pick up or not but it is going to be half off at 22.50 which i think is a great deal so if you did have your eye on that maybe now's the time to pick it up the next thing that's going to be on sale on June 12th is the Tarte um, Lights Camera Lashes 4-in-1 
um, mascara. The original value of this mascara is 23 bucks, but it's going to be on sale for $11.50. Personally, for me, I think this is a really nice one. For $11.50, I would probably recommend it for sure because, I mean, that's such an amazing deal. I don't know if I would ever purchase it for the full price tag because we usually get them in little kits here and there, free with purchase. So I feel like it would be a waste to purchase it for $23. Bucks. But for $11.50, I think it's a really, really nice one. For me, I used to own it. I finished off a few tubes. I like it, but I'm not in a place in my life now where I need another um, mascara. So for me, I'm just going to hold off on it and be strong, even though I think it's priced pretty well. But... A part of me kind of feels like I don't need it at this second in my life. Let me wait a little bit and maybe when Ulta is going to do the 21 Days of Beauty event, you know, in September, which is quickly approaching us, um, it might be, you know, half off then. So maybe then I'll pick it up. But for now, I'm going to go ahead and skip out on it. However, it is a really nice mascara if you are curious. Moving on to Jude 12th. Um, on Thursday, we're going to be having the It Cosmetics Confidence in, in Eye Cream. Um, that's going to be half off. See, the original value of this is 38 bucks, but it's going to be on sale for 19 I do have a few eye creams that I like, that I enjoy. I'm not going to lie. I'm not super beyond consistent with eye cream. I'm trying to be more consistent with everything in general. But with eye cream, it's just like, I just kind of always forget about it, even though I need it ASAP, like every single time. Um... I love, love, love the confidence in a moisturizer by It Cosmetics. I got it in BoxyCharm. It's actually the moisturizer. One second, I want to show you guys. I'm not lying. Oh, it's actually the moisturizer that I'm using currently, and I'm obsessed with it. You guys can see pretty much halfway gone. I love, love, love this. So since I love that, a part of me is kind of pretty intrigued by seeing that the eye cream is going to be half off. So for that one... There's like an 80% chance that I might pick it up. The next thing that's going to be on sale on Thursday, June 13th, are the Benefit Cosmetics box powders. I really, really love their box powders. The original value of their box powders are 30 bucks, but they're going to be on sale for 15 And I think that goes for all of them. So we get the Hula Bronzer that's going to be 15 instead of 30 the Hula Light. 15 instead of 30 the California blush the Rockator blush so all of their box powders uh, which includes basically blushes and bronzers I would definitely recommend the hula or hula light depending on your skin tone I really love that I love California as well you guys know this I own it in a small size so I would definitely recommend that for 15 bucks if you can get the full size as opposed to the small one for 15 yes um, in regards to the other box powders, I have never owned, I never owned any of them like in the singular form. I own a few of them in a palette, um, but I do enjoy them. Like they're nice quality powders and I feel like it's a vibe to kind of collect all of them. If you were curious about these, I think it would be the time to pick it up on Thursday. But definitely the Hula, Hula Light and or the California blush. You'll be so happy with that. It's the perfect summer staple. Moving on to Friday, June 14th, we have the Benefit Cosmetics Gimme Brow Volumizing Brow Gel. The original value of this was $24, bucks, but it's going to be on sale for $12. This is one that I actually already own. I purchased it during the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty event, I want to say. I picked mine up in the shade number four because that's typically what I wear. Love this. Amazing. For $12, bucks, yes. For $24, it's like a little bit up there. But I feel like for 12 bucks, it's kind of like amongst the drugstore prices. So again, if you were curious about it, if you like Benefit Cosmetics, if you enjoy their bra products, that is definitely a staple in my routine. So I would recommend it 100%. The next product that's going to be on sale is one of my favorites. This is the Lancome Monster Big Mascara. Original value is 25 bucks, but it's going to be on sale for $12.50. This is also one that was on sale during the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty event, I want to say. I ended up purchasing two, gifted one to my sister-in-law because I'm like, yo, you need you just need to try this. And then I kept one for myself. I don't even know where mine is. I think I lost it or it's somewhere in my drawer. This is a bomb high-end mascara. So good. I promise you guys. It's like probably probably one of my top five favorite mascaras of all, all time. A drugstore high-end. Like it's up there with like Essence Lash Princess and like the YSL The Shock Mascara. Like those three are like I think my life. But yeah, this is just like perfection it's not too wet it's not too dry the formula the brush is a natural bristled brush it really coats your lashes beautifully in a thick way washes off easily when you want it to be washed off i'm telling you guys wow i'm telling you it's so good uh, moving on to saturday june um 15th on this day we're going to be having the um, Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Lotion and Gel. So the full size is 4.2 ounces. Original value is 28 bucks, but it's going to be on sale for 14 Personally, I've never tried this, but I do know a lot of you guys say you love this moisturizer. So you'll have to let me know like, if it's your ride or die and if you're like, Leo, you need it in your life, then I'll possibly pick it up. 
but I can't recommend it just because I've never tried it. However, I know a lot of you guys do enjoy it, so just have in mind it's going to be half off on Saturday. The next thing that's going to be on sale on Saturday is a palette that I really love. I haven't used it in a very long time, but I think it's going to be priced amazingly, like literally. So it is the ABH Sultry Palette. The original value of this is 45 bucks, which is what I purchased it for during the holidays. I believe that's when I purchased it. But it's going to be on sale for $22.50. Now, this is definitely more of a cooler toned eyeshadow palette. I did do a look using this. I'll try to have that link down below if you guys want to check that out prior to purchasing this if you want to. It is similar to the Urban Decay... What was that new palette they released? Smoky Smoked Palette? I don't remember, but... It is pretty similar to that. I love Urban Decay and I love ABH, but if I had to choose like one of the palettes, since they're both pretty, pretty <laughs> since they're both pretty similar, I would probably choose the ABH one just because it's a bit more pigmented and you can kind of get that light look, but also that dramatic look with the Urban Decay one. Like you can get the dramatic look, but you have to work a little bit more, you know. If you are a cool toned eyeshadow lover, this is really pretty. And it's it's also really nice to wear on a day-to-day -day basis depending on what kind of look you're going for It also has a nice amount of neutrals without being too cool toned So you can go for a neutral look or for a very cool toned look, but it's definitely not a warm toned palette I really like it. I think it's pretty unique to the makeup world and I think for twenty two fifty, you just cannot go wrong moving on to Sunday June 16th we have the Philosophy purity made simple extractor mask uh, the original value of this is 35 bucks but it's gonna be on sale for $17.50. I actually purchased this for the reduced price tag also I believe during the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty event. I love this mask. I'm gonna be sharing with you guys my bathroom tour shortly. I think I want to say hopefully next week. I wanted to put up this week but it didn't work out. Anyways whenever I put on a mask like I'm sitting there and thinking but there's always three or four masks that I gravitate towards and this is definitely one of them. I am not just saying that because it's on sale. I really really enjoy it. I find that it really helps with texture on my face and I don't know about pores necessarily because I'm not going to sit here and lie and be like, yeah, it makes my pores so small, but it really helps with texture. It's really easy to wash off. It's not like that annoying ass mask that you're like rubbing and rubbing and rubbing and you're like, I don't have patience for this. I love it. It doesn't irritate my skin and I find that the next day, like the day after I use this, my face will feel like a butt and I'm down for butt faces. So I love it and I would recommend it. Now, the next two things that are going to be on sale on the 16th are the Too Faced Natural Palettes. So the original value of these guys were 38 bucks, but they're going to be on sale for 19 So Too Faced reformulated their like natural little palettes, their nine pan palettes. I think one has just matte shades and then one has mattes and satin shades but they're very neutral palettes you guys can see from the picture i'll tell you honestly i did purchase these for the full price tag and i ended up I, I ended up purchasing one i believe i ended up decluttering it i just found that i wasn't using it as much as i wanted to there's one that's more cooler tone and there's one that's not warm but more neutral so if you guys are into like these nine pen palettes by um Too faced which i typically am but i just didn't find that i was using the one that i bought but anyways, if you guys are into these palettes, if you did always want it, it did come out last year. The packaging is really beautiful. The quality is really nice. And if it is your color story, if you think you're going to use it, I think for 19 bucks, it's such an amazing deal. Like it's literally an absolute steal. So um, yeah, those are very exciting. I might pick up the other one that I didn't own, not the one that I decluttered. I'm not going to do that again. No. A lot of you guys were like, don't purchase decluttered makeup that you decluttered. And I'm like, okay. Here you. Uh, moving on to June 17th, which is going to be a Monday. The Calvin Klein Deep Euphoria uh, de Perfume <laughs> is going to be on sale from 96 bucks to 48 It's the 3.4 fluid ounce sized bottle. Honestly, this is one that I wanted for such a long time. I remember it was like in my loves list like years ago when I was like 19, 20. I'm like, yeah, I want it. I want it. Time went on and never purchased it. I have I don't think I've ever seen this one at TJ Maxx. I don't know, maybe I have, but it does smell nice from what I remember five, six years ago. If you guys love this, if it's your go-to, please let me know because I am in the market for a new <laughs> perfume. I mean, why not? So let me know. It's gonna be half off at 48 bucks for a 3.4 fluid ounce size bottle. I mean, it's such an amazing deal. The next thing that's gonna be on sale on that Monday is the Tarte Tardist Remix like Pro Remix Amazonian Clay Palette. So the original value of this is $49, but it's going to be on sale for $24.50. What I realized is that Tarte is never at TJ Maxx, surprisingly. I don't know. I would expect them to be, but I have never seen their products there. Oh, only once. Once, once, once. I found the Tarte Shape Tape Foundation, which was crazy. Em and I found it. I was like, what? 
But since then, like never, I don't recall finding any Tarte products, which I find pretty ironic because I would totally expect their products to be there if they're not doing well or if they're on sale or whatever, you know? But anyways, I was holding off on this palette just because I felt like it might be a TJ Maxx, but time has gone, time has passed us. It is not a TJ Maxx for a while. So I did want this palette, but I knew I never wanted to spend the full price tag on it. However, for the $24.50 price tag, I'm like, yes, I can definitely make an exception. I like the colors in here. You get mattes, you get metallics. It's free shipping, so I don't have to spend over 100 bucks. And I definitely think that I'm going to put my alarm on for that day and pick that up because I think it's really beautiful. Even though I'm doing a eyeshadow palette declutter video soon. Moving on to the next day, which is a Tuesday, June 18th. A few NYX products are going to be on sale, so they're going to have them for about 50% off. Now, what I see in front of me are pretty much just their facial mist, but it says here that their mascaras might be on sale and their color correcting palettes as well. I don't color correct, so it's not something that I would pick for myself or really recommend because I don't know much about it. Um, the Hype Mascara, I don't know. But then we have their mists, which is what I want to speak to you guys about. I've been really really curious to see what the, like how their mists perform i have a little selection right up here you guys can see of a bunch of different mists from high-end brands and drugstore brands but i've never tried i don't recall ever trying the next like setting mist i think that the original value of these mists are 12 dollars around there between 8 and 12 but they're going to be on sale for about four to six bucks which i think is amazing and i just don't want to pass up on that i mean imagine like, I'm just buying a NYX mist for 6 bucks and I get free shipping. That's the best. Like, a lot of times I don't buy stuff because I don't want to pay a certain amount to get free shipping. You know what I mean? Then I'm like, forget it. I don't need it. But if I'm getting free shipping anyway for something that I spend $3 on, <laughs> I will take it. Okay, so on the same day, we have the Origins Ginger Burst Savory Body Wash. It has 6.7 fluid ounces of product, which I think is pretty decent i've never smelled this so i'm kind of like oh i don't know you guys know how picky i am with scents but um i've tried a few other origins products and i don't recall any of them ever being like heavy scented or like you know brain explosion feeling you know what i mean like it never gave me a headache so a part of me kind of feels like i want this i also want to kind of start smelling good i'm kidding i always smell good <laughs> at my nose <laughs> no but i'm thinking like i want to try something else so it's gonna be 13 bucks and I think it would be a cool vibe to keep in my shower. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm getting all, like, with it. Um, so I need it in my life, I think. I don't know what the hell I'm saying now, by the way. But I also do know what I'm saying at the same time. <laughs> you guys know what I mean, right? Where you're like, what the heck is wrong with you? Okay, the next day we have up is Wednesday. Um, which is going to be the 19th of June. So... We have, firstly, the Bobbi Brown Extra Lip Tints. Ooh, these look nice. I was not going to pick this up. But uh, the original value of these guys are 34 bucks, which is so expensive. I'm like, I can't fathom that, you know? But they're going to be on sale for 17 bucks. I've never tried these Extra Lip Tints, which basically, from what it seems like, is like a lip balm with a hint of color. Might work with your pH level, might not. I'm not sure if you guys try these. Let me know. But... I've tried other Bobbi Brown lip products and the, her products are beautiful, like really moisturizing, very, very creamy, um, lasts a long time on the lips. And this definitely kind of like intrigues me. I know I do not need any more lip products or lip balms in my life for probably my entire life from here on out. But this looks good, so I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I have to pick one up at least. It looks beautiful. Then moving on to the next few products that are going to be on sale. We have some products from MAC. So the first thing from MAC that's going to be on sale are the Retro Matte Liquid Lip Colors. The original value of these are $22, bucks, but they're going to be on sale for $11. Um, they look really good. It's the Retro Matte Formula, so I think it's going to probably be a bit drying. I don't know for sure because I've never tried these, but if you guys like these, if it's your go-to, please let me know. Like I said, I don't need any more lip products in my life, so... You know what I'm saying? It's not the end of the world if I don't pick it up, but if I need it, then you have to let me you just you have to let me know. And the next thing that's gonna be on sale are their lip glasses. So the regular prices of their lip glasses are about 18 to 21 bucks, but they're gonna be on sale for about nine to ten dollars and fifty cents. I do own a few of their lip glasses. It does hold a very special place in my heart. The first time I purchased a MAC lip glass was when I was 17. I already finished those off, so like it's very nostalgic for me. Personally, I don't love the formula, I find them to be pretty, pretty sticky. If you like that, then you know, definitely go for it. They have a bunch, a bunch of shades to choose from. So, of course, something that's fine for everyone. But for me, I'm probably going to skip out on that. Moving on to the last day, which is June 20th, um, which is a Thursday. We have two products that I've tested out, tried, and own. Um, the first product is the Urban Decay Naked Petite Heat Eyeshadow Palette. The original value of this is $29, bucks, but it's on sale for $14.50. This is the kind of baby palette that I would literally buy a double of if I would see it at TJ Maxx. Like, that's how much I love this little baby. I mean, I wouldn't buy it again, you know, on Macy's just because of that whole placing order situation. But if I would see it, it would be, like, so hard for me to pass it up. 
because this is such a good baby. Like, I think that's that's where like the baby started. You know what I mean? That Urban Decay start this baby situation. So this baby palette is a definite yes. I really, really love it. There are five matte shades and one cream satin shade. A perfect fast go-to on the go palette. You can use it for a dramatic look, an everyday look. I promise you guys, if you've never tried this, I don't know about the other baby palettes from Urban Decay, like the um, Naked Naked Original, Naked 2, I was like, nah. But this one, <clears throat> so cute, delicious, I love it. And then the final thing that's going to be on sale on Thursday is the Too Faced Hangover Replen Replenishing Primer and Setting Spray. Original value of this is 32 bucks, but it's going to be on sale for 16 So I don't own this in the full size, I got it in a Sephora Favorites kit during the holidays. I will tell you guys that I like it. I don't absolutely love it. I am sensitive to scents. You guys know that. And I just kind of feel like this has a little bit of a car service type of scent. And that's not my vibe. You guys know this. <laughs> so I get a little bit of a headache when I use it. I don't think I've ever really spoken about it on my channel per se. It's nice. And I'll use it from time to time. But it's definitely not one that I gravitate towards like right away. And I'm like, oh my gosh, yeah. However, if you are not sensitive to scents and you don't mind scents, even, I don't think, even though I don't think it's more like coconut, I feel like it's more like a car service, but if you're not sensitive to scents, I do feel like it is pretty soothing on the skin. I don't know if it necessarily sets in my makeup, but it's very refreshing and it's something that I like to use prior to putting on my makeup if I use it. Anyways, that's pretty much it. I would absolutely love to know if you guys are going to be picking up anything during this 10-day sale. If it even interests you, if you're kind of like, nah, not really feeling it. I love the fact that you get free shipping though, because that's definitely like the reason why I would purchase something. If you would have to spend over 50 bucks, I'd be like, goodbye Macy's, you know? Ulta, you have my heart. Anyways, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.